What is drilling rig? A drilling rig is a machine that creates hole in the earth's subsurface. It can be used to drill water, oil and gas wells. Please subscribe and press bell icon to receive more videos. Rotary drilling rig system. The rotary drilling rig system can be classified into hosting system, rotary system, circulation system, power system, blowout prevention system, and monitoring systems. Hosting system. The hosting system is a large pulley system with thick steel wire which is used to lower or raise equipment into and out of the well. Hosting system components. The hosting system components consist of drawer, drilling line, ground block, mast or derrick, traveling block, hook, storage reel spool. Over here it is, it is to be noted that ground block is located on the top of the mast or derrick. This is diagram for hosting system. It is called drawer. Whereas this is drilling line, this component is called traveling block. Below traveling block is hook, whereas this is ground block. It have a number of sheaves on it. Whereas traveling block also have a number of sheaves located on it. This component is called deadline anchor, whereas this is called drilling line storage spool, which have extra drilling line spooled on it, or uh, it have storage for the extra drilling line. When drilling line is reel out from the drawer drum or drilling line is released from the drawer drum, the hook and traveling block will move down so the drill string will lower down. If we reel in the drilling line and the drawer drum, the hook and traveling block will move up so the drill string will raise in this way. The part of the line between ground block and draw work is called first line because this line move at the first speed as compared to the rest of the part of the drilling line. Whereas the part of drilling line between ground block and deadline anchor is called deadline because this line remains stationary. Rotary system. The drilling rig the rotary system includes all of the equipment used to achieve the bit rotation. The rotary system on drilling rig can be of two types. First one is the Kelly system and another one is the top drive system. In Kelly system, the rotary table will provide power to the master bushing and master bushing will rotate the Kelly bushing and Kelly pushing will turn the Kelly and drill string. In this picture, this is the traveling block. Low traveling block is hook. With the hook, the survival is hanged. And this is the elevator. And this is the elevator link. With this elevator and elevator link, we can we can latch the elevator around the drill string and we can raise or lower the drill string. Whereas this is the top drive system. As the name indicates, the top drive will rotate the drill string just from the top. Because top drive will be connected with the drill string on the top and the TDS motor will provide rotation to rotate the drill string. The circulation system is used to circulate drilling fluid down through the drill string and up the annulus carrying out the drill cutting from the face of the bed to the surface. From this diagram we can see the circulation system consists of all these components. The mud pump suck the fluid from the suction tank or active tank. 
by suction line and after that it discharge the mud to the discharge line from discharge line drilling fluid goes to the stand pipe and after that it enter into the rotary hose from the rotary hose drilling fluid pass through swivel drill spring and then it exit from the nozzle of the bit and move up inside the annulus and reach to the surface and the surface drilling fluid with the help of the return line it go to the shield shaker from the shield shaker the course debris are cuttings drilled cuttings are removed by the shell shaker vibrating screens after that drilling fluid go to the tank from where the center will suck the center feed pump will suck the fluid and give to the descender from where the sand particle will be removed and after that the fluid will go to a tank from where the filter feed pump will suck the fluid and give to the desilter to remove the silt particle and after that the fluid will go to another tank from where centrifuge will suck the fluid and remove a very fine particle from the drilling fluid power system the power system is one of the most important aspect of drilling rig because it is needed to power up all drilling rig system including rotary system circulating system hosting system blowout prevention system and monitoring system depending on the rig horsepower we will have a number of engine generator set available on the rig in this picture we have three engine set generator this is engine set generator number 1 this is engine generator set number 2 and this one is engine generator set number 3 so this engine generator set will use the diesel fuel to operate the generator and generator will will generate the electricity from all these engine generator set electricity is given to power distribution system which can be vft or scr silicon control rectifier or variable frequency drive scr is used in case of direct current and vft is used in case of alternating current if we have scr power distribution system on the rig then it mean we will have dc motors working with rotary table draw work tds or mud pumps in case if we have vfd power distribution system on the rig it mean we will have ac motors ac electric motors on rotary table with draw work with tds and also with the mud pumps so electric power from power distribution system is then given to all these individual rig component including mud pump tds draw work rotary table even we will have the electric power for lighting purposes on the rig floor 
on the mask we will have the electric supply for the mud tank system or circulation system similarly we will give electric power for the mini cam on the on the right where we will have the accommodation for important personnel who will be required for the drilling operation depending on the nature of the operation either we are drilling or we are tripping or we are going to have some other operation it will depend that how much we have the workload according to that we will need the number of engine generator we need to keep running the maximum power required on the rig it will be when we will go for the hard back reaming in this scenario while hard back reaming we will be rotating the string with the tds meanwhile with the draw work we will be host we will performing the hosting operation as well and mud pump will also be running for the circulation so this is the case on the rig when we will have maximum power required to perform this operation whereas minimum operation it will be required when mud pump tds draw work and rotary table will be in standby mode and it will happen only when we will go for wire line operation in that case we will need minimum electric power that will be only for power for lighting on the mast or direct on the rig floor and on the mud system and the power required it will be only for the mini mini camp as well it is important to note over here that our rig can have vfd drive or scr drive and it is also possible that rig may have the hybrid system i mean it may have vfd and scr both together for example if mud pumps drive works rotary table have dc motor then we will use sar to run these these rig equipment if tds have ac motor then we will need vfd to run the tds with the ac current blowout prevention system blowout prevention system consists of accumulator bop control panel analog bop pipe ram variable bore ram blind ram or shear ram mud cross kill line choke line choke manifold choke control panel mud gas separator or pour boy what is blow out a blowout is the uncontrolled release of crude oil or natural gas from oil well or gas well after pressure control system have failed blowout is the worst case scenario outcome of a kick if we could not control the kick due to any reason it will result in the form of blowout and it can result in a catastrophe in the form of personal fatality or injuries and environmental damage property damage or equipment damage blowout prevention system blowout prevention system or bop is assembly of specialized valve are similar mechanical devices installed during drilling between wellhead and the drill floor 
It is used to seal, control and monitor the valve in case of cake. Monitoring system The red monitoring system is used to monitor the drilling parameter like mud tanks, volume, ROP, rate of penetration, WB, weight and bit, torque, drill string weight and SPP that is standby pressure, etc. If you want to dig more deeper about rotary drilling rig system, we highly recommend to take online course that is how rotary drilling rig system work a complete guide why should you take this course it took me couple of years to master this concept but i will get you where i am just few hours of this course the information in this course is worth well over 900 but i am going to sell this course for just few bucks so this is very good deal and this course is very cheap and you will get much more information as compared to its price. I highly recommend you to enroll this course because this course is very interesting, enriched with valuable course content. You have 30 days guarantee money back in case if you are not happy with the course content. So you will not lose even a single penny. After taking this course, if you like the course content, please do rate the course and leave review. Thank you very much for your time. You can find the link of this online course inside the video description. We create discount coupon code time to time. But these coupon codes are for limited time. If you want to save money and don't want to pay full price of the course, you can ask for discount coupon code inside the video comments you can also ask for the coupon code with the email you can write us email on the email address you can see on the screen and also you can find this email address inside the video description